comparing the Gillette Pro Glide Shield with the uh, oh that's this one with the Gillette Fusion Five. They're both five blade razors. The shield has uh, two lubricating blades. It keeps you from getting too close to the skin. That's why it's called the shield. And uh, Fusion Five is just your basic fly blade razor. It's got some kind of a lubrication strip, but. Uh, well, it's got two actually, they're just not as thick as the ones on the shield. I already started with the shield. You can shave really fast with it, I just don't like it because the shield keeps the blades too far from your skin. So you kind of have to press down a little bit too hard to get close enough to the skin, which defeats the purpose of the shield, and then you get like nicks and cuts, so I absolutely hate it, but... It is a really comfortable shave because it won't let you get close to the skin. So here we go with the uh, Gillette Fusion 5. It's hard to go wrong with the Gillette 5 blade razor of any type. They're all extremely comfortable and really quick. So you're pretty safe as long as you don't get the protective ones like the shield or the skin guard. I've been out of the shower for a while now. My skin feels great with both of them, although the winner is definitely the Gillette Fusion 5. I'm kind of biased. I hate the Gillette Pro Glide Shield, but I'm still forcing myself to compare it to all my razors. But uh, the lubricating strips are just too strong, keeps it too far away from your skin, which makes you want to push harder to get a closer shave, and then your skin gets irritated, which defeats the purpose of the shield. The Fusion 5 is a really solid razor. It's one of the best razors you can get that's non-powered. Uh, most of the Gillette Fusion 5, or most of the Gillette 5 blade razors are, as long as you don't get a safety one like the Shield or the Skin Guard, are the only safety ones I've tried so far. So, winner, winner, winner.